I don't move around with uncertified niggas. That's real. And Every it, nigga I move around with is certified. certified. And, and Jay Prince taught me that. He, that's real. Me? Like when I first went to Houston, Jay Prince was the first one to take me to Houston. Mm. And I stayed two months with him. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see me. Uh, I got people over there, man. Yeah. Uh, and, and to be honest with you, I've been growing my base over there. It's time Boss Talk got to pull up in Milwaukee. Yeah. I got people in that thing. I'm going to pull Steve up, o, man. That's all you need. Yeah, Steve yeah, o. yeah. I'm going to pull it up, <laughs> man. Pull up with Steve-O, you good? I'm good. Check in. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta ask you about that. Yeah, what do you think about, about the check that. in? Like, yeah, you gotta, you, you know, is it important? Um, well, it's the way you look at the word check in. Exactly. Some people get the word. See, from New York, we take check in as extorting. Mm. So Correct. When you tell us check in. We be like, nigga, fuck you talking about? Who you talking to? <laughs> because the way you saying it. We don't understand that slang. You saying check in? That sounds like extort. <laughs> sounds exactly so like extort. You know what I mean? But when you break it down, and somebody saying, "Yo, man." I think you just need to move around the city with some some other some other folks to keep it, you know what I mean? Cause we love we love to get active too. Yeah. So we don't never feel like any state we go to, I don't care where we at. We you know, just being from Brooklyn, New York, we active too. We always gonna feel. That's why you always see DJ. Oh, Brooklyn, New York. Cause we didn't really give a fuck where we at. We gonna get active just as anywhere you at. And everybody feels like that. Everybody. Every Detroit. Feels like that. Mm. Milwaukee feels like that. Chicago feels like that. You know what I mean? Yeah, so, yeah. whoever, you know what I mean? You just got to be smart and just embrace whatever you embrace. Like me, I checks in. Yeah. And that's yeah. not a, about extorting. And nobody extorting me. I just check in because there's, there's a respect. The same way if somebody came and they came to New York and they need to move around. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? I'll let them know how to move around. Like you can't you can't come to somebody's hood and, and act like you know. What's going on there? Or set up there, or just act like you the guy in the, in the hood? Like it's, Cause it's they gonna check you. Yeah, yeah. Well, see, this that's the thing about the checking. <laughs> see, once again, you like you rub your elbow. We don't, we don't, we don't, we adapt. We don't adapt well to somebody telling us they're gonna check us. Like we supposed to? Oh, you gonna check us? So we gonna run, or we gonna move, or we? Nah, we ain't them niggas. We flying into your city. We you know we gonna fly into Milwaukee. We gonna fly into Detroit. We gonna fly into Chicago. And it is what it is. I, like we, we Brooklyn, New York. We New York. It don't matter Bronx. It don't matter. We coming wherever you at. You especially if you the one with the mouth. <laughs> you you know coming with it because we just come on man. You can't do that. No, you can't. You can't say like Dallas. You can't just Perfect pull example. up. Example. You can't just be like yo. You know, how, picture a Dallas nigga going to. Somewhere and somebody telling him, "Hey man, you can't just pull up." No, like, he don't want that shit because mm -mm. he feel the same way at home. Well, yeah. You can't come to my home running through these streets acting like you. That's gonna cause that kind of energy. You get right. what you put out. Right now, if you right. tell me I'm cool and I come and because I'm gonna talk to people like when I go to New York, I got Junebug or I got Conrad, you know, from Queens and Brooklyn, right. and they gonna be like, "E, he right. here." They now gonna pull up. Now that ain't checking in. Now they're my just, people. Right, see what I'm saying? Yeah, That's the same way I feel. <laughs> it ain't about checking in. Just I got people everywhere. Yeah, I got a million niggas in Chicago. I yeah, a million, and they respect it. Yeah, like I don't move around with nothing that's un un. I don't move around with. Uncertified niggas. That's real. And Every nigga I move around with is certified. certified. And, and Jay Prince taught me that. Ahead. That's real. You know I mean? Like when I first went to Houston, Jay Prince was the first one to take me to Houston, mm. and I stayed two months with him. We wow. Had a ball. Kicks it. Wow. wow, man. He showed me the game. He showed me the cows <laughs> with the, with the, the, the with horses, the, uh, and Angus everything. meat, and the the. Um, the rap a lot on the back of the cow's ass. Now, and, already. And he showed me how, you know, how to make that money and, and do this and do that. And then he showed me the compound. Then he introduced me to his son. Brandon, and yeah. And both his sons. And I messed with him. You know Junior. what I'm saying? And mob ties, man. I love them. And it, it, was, and it, was, it was all love. Always. That's Every real. Time I, and I check in. I, I, when I get in, I holler. I call stay down. I get my sandwiches, get my food. <laughs> I run through the city. I put my rap a lot chain on he used to give me. And I run through the city. Dang So you how did you I mean? end up First meeting Like even linking With Jay uh, Prince And the Wyclef Studio Wyclef Studio Yeah okay. Wyclef Studio I forgot who else Was recording that day But it was in Wyclef Studio And Jay Prince was there And I was okay. in there Seeing Wyclef Doing something And Jay Prince was there And I was like Oh oh, gee What's happening He like Hey what's up I'm like Man I know who you is You ain't got to say nothing It's an honor You know what I mean it's We kicked big. it And he liked my mouthpiece 
That's mm-hmm. real. Most that's real. Don't talk to him a certain way, but yeah. I was admiring him like the OG. Like that's real. You know, what I mean, I grew up off you. Yeah, like, yeah, this, yeah. This, yeah, this, yeah. It's the way it's supposed yeah, to be because you know it's I real. Said, I, said, I, said, I said some crazy things to him. You know what I'm saying? That he made me feel like, yo, you crazy. <laughs> I'm like, you come out there. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I was, I was like, give me the blueprint, man. Show me what's, you know, that, what I got to do. Man, and, and, and it's like I say, I, I, I'll never forget that song that uh, uh, my boy DJ Quick, when he said, I went here and it's just like Compton. He named it everything because it reminded him, it's something in the hood and dealing with the structure mm-hmm. that'll remind you to say, hey, man, Listen, you gotta, it can be the same anywhere you go. Yeah, we on Boss Talk TV. Shout out to E-He, the reason you see me.